As we fight for racial equality and inclusion, it's important to remember our children are watching and we are all learning. I had an in-depth conversation on this topic with Dr. Lakeish Parrott. She's the director of the Office of Opportunity and Achievement for Virginia Beach City Public Schools. We're standing together against police brutality. The color of your skin does not matter at all. And that we should all just realize that and just love everybody. I would encourage our parents to take a deep breath and don't miss the opportunity to engage in this co courageous conversation. Be honest with your children about skin color and race no and differences. No and that no some peace. people don't see that as a strength or a positive. You have to share that with your, with your child. Create that environment where your child feels safe to ask questions. And it can simply be, you see them watching the news and you say, what do you think is happening? And listen. Stop talking and listen to what they say. Hear their perspective. So I think that this is a great time for all of us to self-reflect on who are we? What do we value? What do we believe? And then once we have, once we're grounded in our beliefs and our values and seek out like-minded individuals, silence is a response. And um, during this time when everyone has a very strong opinion, and sometimes those racist comments, many times I should say, those racist comments or behaviors go unchecked. I would say that if you hear something or if you see something that is um, not um, equitable, that is not treating others with respect and valuing their um, differences, that you speak up and you speak up and whether that's in person, whether that's through an email, but you say something. So in what ways should schools get involved and why? You'll hear Dr. Parent's response coming up at 815.